Disclaimer. The subject matter has been produced using AI technology and can in no way be employed as fact. The AI works on articles and blogs, so it may only be deemed as what others believe, not necessarily the editor of this video. This video is in no way intended as fact or intended to cause undue stress, only for entertainment value. The disclaimer is produced by Tony of Tony's Music. Thank you. I've been using a longbow for years now and I can tell you that it has helped me to improve my shooting accuracy tremendously. I'm not going to say that you will shoot an arrow with a longbow at any distance, but you will definitely have more consistent results if you learn how to use a longbow. In this article we are going to talk about some of the things that you need to know when you're starting out with a longbow. If you already have a longbow then great, carry on. If you want to use a longbow you need to have one in order to use it. There is no way around this fact. This is because a longbow is a much different type of bow than what you would use in a hunting situation. A longbow is a compound bow. The difference between a compound bow and a recurve bow is that the limbs on a compound bow are held together by a system of cams. These cams allow the limbs to bend at the same time which makes for a much faster draw. You also need to make sure that you have the right type of grip on your longbow. You should only be able to hold the grip in one hand or you won't be able to hold it properly. The grip should be very comfortable and fit your hand well. The next thing that you need to do is to get yourself a good bow stand. This is important because if you don't have a good bow stand then your arrow will wobble when you release it. You can buy one online or you can look around your house for something that you can use. Just make sure that whatever you use is sturdy enough so that it will last for a long time. When you are ready to start shooting you need to make sure that your bow is straight. This is because a crooked bow will not give you the best results. If your bow is crooked then your arrow will not fly straight either. You can use a level to check to see if your bow is straight. You should also take the time to look at the arrow before you shoot it. Make sure that the arrow is pointing straight. Another thing that you need to make sure of is that you have good arrows. You can get arrows that are made specifically for a longbow. These arrows will usually have better fletching, feathers, on them. You should also make sure that you get arrows that are made of high quality materials. You can find arrows that are made from carbon fiber. These arrows will give you the best results. There are many other things that you need to make sure that you do before you start shooting with a longbow. Make sure that you follow all of these tips though so that you can get the most out of your longbow.